constraints. The sixth part of speech is conjunctions. A conjunction is a word to join words or sentences. How can we use them? Not only is followed by but also. For example, not only Razu but also Ramu is coming. Not only Razu but Ramu is uh, coming is a bad expression. In this sense, we can use that. And if is a conjunction that expresses a condition, a real condition, if is followed by simple present tense. For example, like if you will go with him, he will help you. Now, the right expression is if you go with him, with uh, him, he will help you. This is the expression not only is followed by but also like that and if is a condition that expresses condition here. Next is the both is followed by and she and both clever and humble. She is both clever and humble. So in this sense also we can use the conjunction here one more sets more sets here. When statements are changed into indirect speech that is used to join the two. Means who spoke and what is spoken. For example, he said he was not well. The usaging is he said that he was not ill. The conjunction as well as is uh, followed by a singular form, singular verb which it begins with a singular subject. For example, we can Mohan as well as his friend is coming. Here, don't use the plural verbs here saying is coming. Okay. Next one is uh, the conjunction scarcely is followed by when. Rajni had scarcely stepped out of her house. It began to rain is a bad expression. Good expression is Rajni had scarcely stopped, sorry, stepped out of her house when it begins to rain. The time you have to use when, when, scarcely means if you use the conjunction scarcely, that will be, that must be followed with when. Yeah, no sooner is a conjunction that is followed by than no sooner than no sooner than like you have to use no sooner did Rosu come his brother went out not like that but the correction is corrected one is no sooner did Rosu come than his brother went out next is a uh, lest is a conjunction followed by should or not or for example keep the money safe or you should lose it. The right expression is keep the money safe lest you should lose it. The conjunction whether is followed by or for example we do not know whether he will agree to our terms. The right expression is we do not know whether he will agree to our terms or not. And tenth one you see neither nor and either are a conjunction here. Neither nor is used to show a negative co comment or statement, and either or is used to indicate a positive or affirmative sentence. Positive sentence or affirmative sentences. Some sentences I have given here. Neither Ravi nor his brother has not come. Here in this negative sentence. Neither Ravi nor his brother has come. Right? Yeah. This is about the conjunctions we are explained about uh, yeah conjunctions only. If you follow my classes just you are requested to subscribe my channel and share it and uh, like 
and before going to listen me my class suppose you are requested to subscribe my channel right thank you much for being with me thank you much one and all thank you i love you